Let's talk about not thing. <laughs> not thing is super basic as a move, but it is happening all the time. And so understanding it is really important. It's basically about identity, the identity of something and recognizing the other or the not thing. So this is the thing, this is the not thing, and we can think of a few examples probably to make this more uh, applicable. Well, so let's start with the in real life thing. Yeah. Right, in real life. Yeah. I'm gonna make myself the identity. Okay, so Laura is the identity. Which means you are. Not Laura. Yes. So that's kind of interesting because Derek is not Derek. He's not Laura. Right. Right. But at the same time, you could be the identity. I could be the identity. And you are not Derek. Yes. So yes. Laura, in this case, is not Derek. Interesting. You know what it reminds me of? Yeah. Do you remember when our son was small? Yeah. I mean, I know you remember. And he had all of those uh, matchbox oh, cars. Yeah. And yeah. he had cars. And he had trucks. And he had a bunch of different vehicles. Yep. I know he was tiny. Yeah, and he said, he said, Daddy, this is a car, and this is a not car. Right. Right. And he was talking about trucks, but he hadn't learned the word for trucks yet. So he was building his sort of cognitive landscape of there's this thing called a car, and he knew that, mm -hmm. and he knew these things weren't cars, but he didn't have a word for them yet. So they were just not cars, and they'll remain not cars forever. But eventually, they'll also become trucks. And then cars would be not trucks. Yeah, it gets kind of... That's okay, cool. so I would imagine... Let's think of something maybe more practical. We can't just talk about our own kids. And things yeah, that's time. true. So one of the things we were talking about is in business, when you're trying to figure out your market. Yeah. Like, who are your customers? What's your market? Market. Not market. So what's the other to the identity of your market. So you have to figure out what your market is. And a huge part of figuring out what your market is, is figuring out what your market isn't or the not market. So maybe you're saying, well, we're not selling to kids and we're selling to 25 to 45 year olds. Right. So we're not selling to them and we're not selling to kids. And so our market is 45 to 65 year olds or something like that. Right. Right. And then um, we would further define that, that have a certain type of problem or an issue yeah, that we're exactly. trying to solve or exactly. something like that. Well, that makes me think about, you know, how, how we start to understand what things are by understanding what they aren't. So I think about, for example, say I have a situation and I'm starting to feel something about it. Yeah. And I'm trying to figure out literally what I am feeling, which I guess is the thing or the identity. Yeah. So right? in this case, your identity or the thing is kind of a question mark. And mm -hmm. so we're gonna figure out what the other is to help us with that question mark. So it's like, is is it anger? No, it's not anger, no. Uh, is it fear? Yeah, uh, no, it's not fear. Is it happiness? You know, no, it's not quite happiness. Is it sadness? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, okay, I'm, I'm, I think I'm feeling sad, right? Uh, and so kind of a process of elimination of the other gives you the identity so it's simple very simple but it's important important and ubiquitous meaning it's happening literally every second of every day so that's it for not thing <laughs>